space, the final frontier. This vast cosmic ocean has hooked humanity's imagination for ages, but many mysteries still lurk in the dark depths of space, leading to widespread myths and misconceptions. So get ready to blast off as we debunk five common myths about space in three, two, one, ignition. Myth number one, there is no gravity in space. In reality, gravity exists everywhere in space. The idea of weightlessness is a common misconception. You see, gravity is actually responsible for keeping everything in orbit. On the ISS, astronauts float around because the station is constantly falling freely around the Earth. This perpetual falling creates the illusion of zero gravity. But without the sun's gravitational pull, the Earth would shoot off in a straight line into deep space instead of staying in orbit. Likewise, without Earth's downward pull, the ISS and its occupants would simply drift away on their own. Gravity keeps celestial objects anchored together even when moving at tremendous speeds. So floating astronauts experience microgravity, not an utter lack of gravitational forces. They're just always smoothly falling and missing the Earth. Myth number two, there's no sound in space. In the vacuum of space, with no atmosphere, sound waves have no medium to travel through. So logically, it seems space is silent. But that's not entirely true. Sound can travel through objects like spacecraft hulls or spacesuits. Astronauts have reported hearing whistles, purrs, and hisses inside their equipment, but they can't hear their own voices through the air. Spacewalks are conducted in true silence. Powerful explosions like supernovas do emit acoustic shock waves that travel incredibly vast distances. But space is a very poor conductor of sound, so it's doubtful we could hear cosmic phenomena from Earth. Myth number three, asteroids are giant space rocks. Popular culture envisions asteroids as colossal craggy boulders tumbling through space, but most asteroids are relatively tiny. Over 80% of discovered asteroids are less than one mile wide. That's tiny compared to the six mile wide asteroid that crashed into Earth and doomed the dinosaurs. Even massive asteroids are often porous piles of rubble loosely held together by gravity rather than solid chunks. But here's the crazy part. Even a relatively puny 500 foot asteroid packs the same energy as a one megaton nuclear bomb. That's because asteroids zip through space at blistering speeds up to 56,000 miles per hour. At that speed, even a pebbled-sized piece delivers the punch of a cannonball. So asteroid size doesn't directly relate to its destructive power. Tiny ones can cause just as much explosive damage by moving unimaginably fast. Myth number four, black holes suck everything in. Contrary to sensational sci-fi, black holes don't actively vacuum in surrounding objects. They're not cosmic vacuum cleaners. They do suck in anything that gets too close, past a boundary called the event horizon. But far away from that inner mouth, they have the same gravitational pull as equal mass stars or planets. You could happily orbit around it without getting sucked in, just like how the Earth safely orbits the Sun without getting slurped. The difference is that the black hole's enormous mass is compacted into an extremely small space instead of being spread over a large area. This allows the gravitational pull to be much stronger once you get closer. Past the event horizon, not even light can escape being swallowed. Myth number five, the sun is yellow. We've all seen children book illustrations of a big yellow circle representing the sun, but the sun isn't really yellow. It just appears that way. The sun's surface emits electromagnetic waves across the entire visible spectrum. When combined, the various colors merge into white light. But as this white light travels the 93 million miles to Earth, our atmosphere acts like a color filter. It scatters blue and violet light across the daytime sky, leaving more red and yellow hues that give the sun a yellowish tint. In space, the sun would appear white to the naked eye, with a bit of blue and violet. And that's five common space myths debunked. Let us know if you have any other cosmic confusions bugging you, like pesky little asteroids. The quest for knowledge never ends here at Science Symphony.